Hello, everybody. Welcome to Read a Page a Day by Chokur Sumling. And today we are reading page 12, day 12 of this wonderful book, Lamrimia, Making Life Meaningful Day by Day, uh, Lama Yeshe and Kyabji Lama Zutra Rinpoche. And this wonderful book has been published by Lama Yeshe Wisdom Archive, Boston. And their website allows you to sign in and get daily updates um, of the same book uh, via your email. So why don't you sign up? The website is www.lamremia.com. And today I'm going to be reading um, from day 12. This is not a rehearsed reading. So if there are any mistakes, I request you to please forgive me for this. And let's start. <clears throat> day 12. Quote, the merit we accumulate in an instant by making offerings to our Guru is unimaginable. End quote, Lama Zutpa Rinpoche. Text, we become closer to enlightenment not only by practicing the advice given to us by our Guru, but even by making offerings to our Guru, showing them respect and serving them. This is because in order to achieve enlightenment, we need to accumulate extensive merit and the supreme merit field is the virtuous friend. If we make offerings to our Guru, we can accumulate in a moment the extensive merit that would take an inconceivable number of eons to accumulate to following any other path. Sacrificing ourselves by making charity of our body e and even our life to other sentient beings for <clears throat> 1,000 eons, a great length of time, is incredible. But as far as finishing the work of accumulating merit is concerned, simply offering one glass of water to a virtuous friend accumulates as much merit. We create infinite merit, and this infinite merit is received through the kindness of our guru, through our having a guru-disciple relationship with them. We have so many incredible opportunities to collect merit. We don't have to make offerings only far away in the East. Even by making offerings to the Guru's force, to any being who is related or, or related to or belongs to our Guru, we collect more merit than from having made offerings to numberless Buddhas. Also, our offerings doesn't need to be only food. It can include supporting the meditation center itself through a building project or something similar. We are then helping all the students of the center and everyone who comes there to learn dharma. This naturally becomes an offering. The three recaps from today's reading. The guru is the supreme field through which we accumulate extensive merit. Simply offering a glass of water to the Guru creates unimaginable merit. We also collect merit by offering to the force of the Guru and by supporting a center. Thank you all. That was, that was all for today. Have a great day or night wherever you are. See you tomorrow. Bye.